Meghan Markle is expecting her first child imminently, but there has been a lot of speculation whether she is expecting a girl or boy and now there are reports she is raising her baby gender fluid. Kensington Palace has weighed in on a story about the way Meghan plans to raise her child. Vanity Fair reported that Meghan and Harry are planning to raise their baby gender fluid. But the palace issued a rare statement to dispute the claims, a move they do not tend to make. According to Hello! Kensington Palace said reports the Duchess and Duke of Sussex will raise their child with a fluid approach are totally false. A palace spokesman said on Saturday, this story is totally false. The Vanity Fair article reports Meghan told friends they plan to raise their child in a gender-neutral way and with a fluid approach. The source said, Meghan has been talking to some of her friends about the birth and how she and Harry plan to raise their baby. Her exact word was fluid. She said they plan to raise their child with a fluid approach to gender and they won't be imposing any stereotypes. Katie Nichol, who wrote the article, said there could be multiple interpretations to what Meghan meant by fluid. According to the story, the royal couple have decorated the baby's nursery with a white and grey color scheme, rather than the conventional blue or pink color way. A study in the Journal of Experimental Child Psychology, children enrolled in Sweden's gender-neutral kindergarten system had access to more opportunities, which the researchers predicted would equate to more success as adults. The last time the royal press offices have commented on a story was at the height of the Meghan and Kate feuding reports. Buckingham Palace said a story alleging Kate slapped down Meghan and told her not to berate members of Kate's team at Kensington Palace was false. The palace told the Mirror, this never happened. Recently, Meghan flew from London to New York to celebrate her baby shower with some of her closet friends. A friend said, the trip is a lovely chance to catch up with friends and spend time in a city she loves. This will be the last time a lot of them will see Meg after the baby is born so it's nice to share precious moments. It's been a relaxing visit. Nothing bees face time with your friends. Meg will be flying home refreshed and relaxed, and with a lot of new baby clothes.